Demand for cooking gas reduces drastically as Nigerians, Nigerians struggle with soaring prices. Exactly. The demand will drop now. No people will go for sawdust. People will go for firewood. People will go for charcoal. Another means of heating this time around. I tell you the truth. Because it looks like LPG, uh, which is the cooking gas, is more of a luxury now for the world to do. It's no longer for the masses to use, which is actually a very bad situation we're finding ourselves here. Okay, so the demand will definitely drop. And by the time the demand will drop now, marketers will be forced to start selling at a cheaper rate, and then APC will come and tell you price is dropping, things are getting better, <laughs> when it is not. Hmm. But again, let's dive into the details. Recent insights from gas retailers highlight a concerning trend. The demand for liquefied petroleum gas, commonly known as the cooking gas, has sharply declined despite government efforts to augment supply and encourage local consumption. Punch reports that the reasons behind this uh, downturn in demand are rooted in the financial constraints consumers uh, are facing. So gas retailers in various neighborhoods reveal that the demand for cooking gas has dwindled noticeably due to the financial strain experienced by consumers attributed primarily to the low income and, and diminished purchasing power of the Naira. Uh, our retailer from Esolo, Akileye, voiced concerns about the overarching impact of inflation, stating that prices of essential goods and services have surged beyond average citizens' uh, reach. Consequently, consumers now purchase smaller quantities of cooking gas or resort to alternative cooking methods like kerosene or charcoal. I know. So the prevailing market prices for a 12.5 kg cylinder um, ranged between 11,000 and 12,000, depending on the uh, locality, showcasing the strain on consumer budget. President of the Nigerian Association of Petroleum and Natural Gas uh, Marketers, Dakbo Olatun Bosun, acknowledged the government's recent effort, including consistent local supplies facilitated by the Nigerian Liquefied Natural Gas Limited, which has stabilized prices. However, he expressed concern over the one winning demand okay, for cooking gas, attributing it to consumers' economic uh, challenges. And that is it. While detailing the current situation, Olatu Bosun highlighted that although prices have stabilized at around 16 uh, million naira per 20 metric tons, the demand remains subdued due to ongoing economic constraint. He indicated a modest um, expectation of increased demand in December, but suggest it wouldn't be significant uh, significantly higher than previous years. The recent inflations or fluctuations in prices and supply uh, and supply chains have been a concern, leading to interventions and discussions between the government and the regulatory bodies. The regulatory bodies prompted by the outcry from gas retailers have been summoned to address the price surge and ensure market stability. The price is stable for now. It could have gone up if not for our cry every depot is wet now supply is better price is stable at 16 million naira per 20 metric tons it could have been worse but demand is um, falling amidst the low income and poor purchasing power of people hope demand may go up slightly in december but would not be significant when compared with previous years, he said. Olatu Bosu reiterated an Im the importance of government intervention to stabilize prices and bolster uh, supplies. He emphasized that if cooking gas were more affordable, it, could, it would be accessible to a broader consumer base, thus mitigating the current supply demand uh, gap. Despite these challenges, hopes remain high for a price reduction as the government intervenes. intervenes. So Latumbosu assured that concerted efforts 
would prevent projected price increases, providing relief to consumers in the coming weeks. Mm. This is and meanwhile, APC government will say uh, prices are dropping because government is doing something. Nothing is happening. As long as the citizens don't have good job, they don't have means of livelihood, their purchasing power is dropping, inflation is high, this situation according to be like this. We have not done the right thing as a nation and as a government. That is it. Eh? We have not done the right thing yet. We are just singing and singing. We are just singing and singing and tell you the truth. We have not done the right thing. Okay, the government need to look at it. And it's not if they don't know the right thing to do. For some reason, they just won't do it because of their selfish interest, which is an unfortunate situation. You can imagine cooking gas now is no longer accessible by common Nigerians because of inflation and bad governance. Uh, people are already reacting to this statement. Somebody said, uh, bad conditions of an expired uh, country. <laughs> Stranded Nigerians. Our charcoal and firewood still exist, Abi. Nigerians will go for the charcoal and firewood. That is it. The thing, the sweet me. Let us suffer all. Yeah, yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, nation. <laughs> Not a small thing. Anything that looks the masses are benefiting from, it soon goes out of the reach of the masses. My joy is that every wasobia, they collect water, water. Not a small thing, you know. Every wasobia, of course. The every Nigerian, that is what it means. Please save Nigeria from this hardship. They can't. And they won't. Eh? Who will save Nigeria? And that's what Nigerians want. Make with the face arm. Of course, because in the midst of all of these things, you see some poor people that will come and support the government and support on tribalistic basis. Meanwhile, things are terribly bad. Yorubas and Aosa Fulanese uh, people are buying it at 200 naira uh, per kg. Okay, it's only Igbos and other tribes is buying it at 1,200 naira. Per kg. <laughs> that is small thing. You know. Okay. Um, somebody is saying everything on that movie is going higher and higher every day. I don't really understand this satanic government of Tinubu. Okay. Who claims he knows it all? This man is evil and he, and, uh, he must not last in this office. Okay. That's your own. And they tell you, he looks like if he's a wizard because they don't want anything good for Nigerians. Uh, so the question here is that Nigerians are suffering and there's no help nearby. And uh, there's no light at the end of the tunnel. In fact, we don't even see any light on top of end of tunnel. Quite unfortunate situation. So it is a bad one. I don't know how Nigerians can assess the cooking gas. Well, I know that uh, everybody will pray for divine intervention. So thank you for listening and let's have your comment.